Auto locksmiths don't want you to know this tip. If you ever forget your keys inside your car, or even lose your keys, this is an emergency tip. If you don't have a dime in your pocket, this can help you unlock your vehicle. It's a quick and easy tip, and you'll never pay so much for a locksmith to unlock your vehicle again. And this trick is very easy, you will only need a fork and a school ruler. With a fork and a pen, we will be marking these two ends, here and here. Look at where I have marked here. Folks, it is very common for people to tear out the window tint, to try to break into your vehicle, in order to get the keys. We all know that when you call a locksmith, he comes and doesn't charge cheap, so, this tip is for you at home, who have already gone through a situation like this one, we just marked the two ends of the fork. And what will happen now? I'm going to come with a pair of pliers, and look at what we're going to be doing, this part here. I'm going to take it and align it right here. And now I'm going to be tinkering like this, and look guys, this tip is a quick and cheap tip for you to be doing. You there who have a preference for keychains. Look at that, I've already loosened one side of the fork. Now I'm gonna do the other side. And the way I'm doing it, you won't have to rip the rubber off your car, break the glass, or anything like that, just to open the doors. With this wonderful tip, you will be able to open your vehicle in a much more relaxed way, in case of emergency. Now, on some flat, firm surface, you will be leaving this fork straight. And now let's do it like this. Leave our fork straight. And if you're from home, let us know in the comments from which city you are watching us from, and if this has already happened to you. And look how our fork turned out. You saw that it was a little wavy, now it is straight. Now I am going to show you the process we are going to do to unlock this vehicle. And now, using the pliers again, we are going to join the fork's teeth here. It's very important to join the fork's teeth together. It will be like this. And using that ruler that you have at home, we are going to be measuring this joint here. It needs to be 0.1 centimeter, okay folks. If it goes beyond that, it doesn't work. I'm going to be introducing it here, as you saw, I've already measured it, and what am I going to do now? I'm going to insert it and it's going to take a few minutes, because it's not that easy to open the door. The car is locked, I'll show you, completely locked. And you're going to move here until you find the point. It's moving and fitting into the lock. And look at that, folks. I managed to open the car door with this wonderful tip. I'm going to close it now, guys. Here it is already at the point. I closed it, look, it's closed.
I opened the vehicle again, look at that. And to prove to you that this tip works, look what I'm going to do. Here is the key of the vehicle. I did not take the fork off the door because it is with the right point. And what I'm going to be doing. I just locked the key inside the vehicle, which is one of the most common problems that happen in our daily lives. Will you call the locksmith knowing this tip? The car is locked, the fork is in the spot, what am I going to be doing? I hope you enjoyed the tip, a big hug, and see you next tip.